What's going on guys and welcome back to another Urban Legend RC video. On this video, we're going to take a look at this. Holy Stone's latest and greatest rendition of their mini drone. This thing is absolutely awesome. It comes in this nice little carrying case, has a leather strap, as well as the two zipper options. The case does seem to be well constructed. It may even be splash resistant. But let's open it up and let's take a look at what's on the inside. Alright, you have this little phone to protect the drone, controller, and the battery over here on this uh, the side right here. And here's your controller. Your controller, you have your gimbal wheel right here on your left. You have your shutter button right here on the right at the back. In front of that, you have your rate mode, your high-low rate mode. You have your antennas. You have your sticks. You have your return to home button. You have your power button, your calibration button, and then you have your takeoff and land button. And of course, you can put your phone right here in the bottom of the controller. Let's move on to uh, paperwork. Well, on this side, you basically have your charger, your instruction manual, some extra props, and uh, a screwdriver to remove your props and to take the battery cover off the back of your controller. All right, here's the drone. It weighs 276 grams. It has brushless motors, foldable props, as a two axis gimbal with a 2.5K video camera which shoots 4K photos. It has red lights in the front arms. It has green lights in the rear arms. And like I said before, it comes with two batteries which boasts 46 minute flight time for both batteries. I've been getting 18 minutes of flight time per battery because I landed when it starts beeping and it has two bars left. So I'm pretty sure I can get the 23 minutes to add the 23 up to make the 46 for both batteries but I'm basically landing at like 18 minutes so I took it out for a flight today and I landed it within 18 minutes and I came home to give you guys this footage but here's the drone and uh, let's get out here take it for a quick flight and you'll see exactly how it performs I do fly it in high mode because it is a little windy up high so it is moving kind of quickly when I turn you don't get all that, uh, what do you call it? Toilet bowling? You don't get all that toilet bowling from this thing? Like I said, this is the Holy Stone HS 360. This is an awesome little flyer. It does hold very still, very steady in the air. I'm gonna stand still. It does not have optical flow. I mean, for it not to have optical flow, uh, that's pretty steady, guys. But I may have been just hitting the stick. So let me get back in front of it again. Okay. And the wind, wind is picking up. By the way, I feel the wind picking up. But yeah, that's pretty good for no optical flow. As you can see, it's no, no optical flow underneath the bottom. Well, here it is. The Holy Stone HS360 in all its glory. I'm highly impressed with this camera, guys. I don't know if you've seen the same thing I'm seeing right now, but woo wee, this camera quality is absolutely awesome for a budget drone. And this is how it looks directly out of the camera with no type of adjustments. You can add color profile inside of the app, but I didn't do any type of color adjustment. This is Holy Stone's best drone that they have on the market right now. Like I said, this is the Holy Stone HS360 with a two axis gimbal. This is the only full gimbal drone that Holy Stone has released thus far. You know, they have the HS600 that's supposed to be coming out soon. But uh, everything that's on the market right now, this is the best thing that they have going on.
Let me know in the comments below what you think about this camera quality. This 2.5K camera is definitely looking pretty good, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Well, full disclosure, it isn't all that windy today, but the wind is blowing just a little bit. But uh, I have it in low rate mode and I'm gonna click it in high. And I'm not gonna lie, it was footage just like this what convinced me to wanna purchase this drone right here. I purchased this thing off Amazon for $273, shipped right to your door. If you would like to purchase one of these, Affiliate links will be listed below and it does give the channel a minor kickback So it was it will help us keep creating awesome videos like this Overall, I'm highly impressed with the Holy Stone HS 360 I highly recommend it for anybody who's looking for a budget drone a budget camera drone that can shoot 2.5 K videos as well as 4k photos you know like i said you can do color adjustments inside of the app i covered that on another video but i just wanted to take it out and give you guys a first look and see how good this camera quality looks all right this is when i tried to do the circle me mode i am in a small baseball field with uh trees around the outside of it so when i put it in circle me mode it started backing up super fast toward the trees and it scared me so I had to cancel that and I decided I shouldn't do any type of circle me mode waypoints or anything inside of this fence because I probably will end up hitting a tree and crashing my drone so only thing I'm gonna do today is the GPS tracking mode next time I'll take it out I'll do the waypoints the follow me mode the circle me mode and everything else that it has the feature on the drone But mainly, I wanted to test the features that everyone wants to see. How good is the camera quality? Can this thing track? I should have did the follow me mode, but can this thing track? And how good is the camera? You know, that's everybody's main concern when they're trying to buy a camera drone, whether it's a budget camera drone or a more expensive camera drone. They want to see how good is the camera quality. And most of the time, can it do tracking? As you can see, the Holy Stone HS360 with its 2.5K camera, it definitely seems to be a winner. We're gonna take it out and do some more cinematic flights with it. But as you can see, the GPS tracking on this Holy Stone HS360 definitely works great. So I'm gonna take it out and do the follow me, the circle me, as well as the waypoints on the next video. So definitely tune in for that. And I'll show you more of what the app offers and things like that. So stay tuned. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.